as you say, you went to the Pescadores Panku and you said you wanted to speak to the people there. What did you say to them? It was important, I think, uh, to explain to them, maybe we are far away in Europe from Taiwan Strait. But I thought it was really important uh, to let them know that it's not because we are far that we don't think about them. We can't accept that an international place is turned as a Chinese place just because they decide it. They have to respect international law, even China. So too many times people are afraid to, I would say, give the impression that um, they may hurt China. What do you say about standing up to China will be music to the Taiwan government's ears? But how much support is there in France and the European Union for standing up to China? Two years ago, when you looked at the number of uh, senators who were in a French-China friendship group, they were 42 two years ago. French Taiwan, we were 20. How many are we two years later? 42. 42, 42. We renew half of Senate this Sunday. We'll see how many will be with the next Senate. France, though, has a good trading relationship with China. And we saw what happened to Lithuania, for example, when it decided to have closer relations with Taiwan. China cut off trade, it downgraded its diplomatic relationship with Lithuania. How worried are you about China's reaction? Last May, President Macron talked to French people about choose France to uh, get investment, foreign investment in France. The first company mentioned was Prologium, Taiwanese company who decided to invest 5.5 billion euros in France. This unique investment from Prologium is exactly 50% of all Chinese investment in France since 25 years. You know, I think that uh, China needs more Europe than Europe needs China. We don't have to be afraid of China.